just so happy I ended up actually getting a shiny in the stream like I wanted to. I'm so happy. The stream is even more special now. So many things happened and then that happened. That's amazing. Um, so it's kind of hard to know where the shop is. You can read like the signs, but it's like I forget exactly where. No, not that one. This one? Yeah, here we go. Pokeball Boutique. That's where you get the quick balls from. There we go. Cool stuff. Oh, man. I'm gonna fly back to the friend safari PC and just save before that. And then yeah, I'll go back to Pokemon Moon finally. Oh man. I'm just so pumped now after that. See, it takes patience, like that was an easy odd shiny. And you saw how happy I was when I found that thing. Cause you can get lucky or you can get really, you know, not as lucky and like I said, that took about five hours I'm pretty sure to find, so so happy that I found that. So happy. Bushy's gonna be happy too when he gets that. But I doubt that he has a shiny stop box. He does, and that would be pretty amazing. Cause he has some, he has some rare stuff. But I don't know if he has a shiny stop box. I don't know. The sap sipper at that. It's a sweet one. Quite the sweet one. Well, anyways, say twice. And. Go to good old Pokemon Moon. Finally continue on that. I'm gonna check Pokey Pelago. Seems like they still do not want to come with me, but I just got um, a rainbow bean from the Beanstalk, so that's pretty sweet. One more rainbow bean, I can fill that um, box the next time it's empty with rainbow beans. So that's pretty good. Alright. I just saved because I just did that, and I can continue playing Pokemon Moon. Alright, Nate's trainer again. The highest level was 45 that it took last time. Right, I wonder if I'm gonna get even higher. That'd be crazy. That'd be insane. Two Pokemon, okay. Skarmory, ooh, that's a tough one. Who's out in front? Ooh, Raticate. You know what? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. 44, that's not too bad. Um, Crunchy? I'm gonna use Super Fang. Yeah, I'll, oh, we missed the Super Fang. We outsped at least, that's good. Oh, this thing's got a defense boost in the Steel Wing. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, I'm gonna use Super Fang twice then. Screw it. Why not? Agility, this thing's probably gonna outspeed me now.
Yep. Just dealing again. Okay, didn't get the defense boost at least. That's good. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, ho I'm hoping that this crunch will kill. Hopefully. Flash. Uh, we should be able to use that. Yeah, it's pretty good. Nice, killed his Garmory. So I'm sure that Ace Trainer would have healed. Ooh, Sharpedo. Ooh. I'm gonna use the double edge. Ooh, level 45. Okay. Um Z double edge, hopefully. Crunch, we can eat that up. Oh, barely, jeez. Okay, if this thing has rough skin, my Radicate's gonna die. It's gonna faint. So well, unless saying that I might one-shot this thing, I might. Very well possible. I don't know, though. Not too sure about that one. Oh, well, yeah, we one-shot it, but I think it had a rough skin. Oh, we got lucky! He didn't, because we would have just had way too experience. Sweet. Sweet deal. I think Radicate's ready to train up as well. Oh, I didn't, oh, I didn't have the amulet coin on. Nope. Saucer settings. I know that was an amazing battle and all, but nah. I didn't have the amulet coin on. I don't know why I didn't remember to do that, but yeah, I know. If I can get more money, then I will. I absolutely will. That's what the amulet coin is for. <laughs> you got to be freaking kidding me. It's an amazing battle, and then I just had to reset because I didn't have the amulet coin. Wow. The only reason why I realized that is when I clicked on Radicate to check how much experience you have left. Alright, let's try this again, Ace Trainer. You probably have no idea who I am, but I just defeated you in another in another save dimension. So, we're going to have to try this again. Well, hopefully we won't miss the Super Fang. That would be cool. That would be great. And hopefully this thing doesn't get the defense boost. That would also be great. <laughs> and then again, it didn't really matter, but we'll see. See, it landed the first Super Fang, because I want to do Super Fang twice. Metal Sound, we dodged it. Okay, we're doing well. It's doing a lot better. Okay, we landed the second Super Fang, so we're all good. As long as we hit this crunch. Oh, we dodged Metal Sound twice. Twice. That's what I'm talking about. Can we hit this crunch? Holy moly! Our luck this time. Okay, we got this then. Easy peasy. The Sharpedo's going down. We're gonna be fine against the Sharpedo. He may have outspeed me, but we're fine. Z double edge will. Oh. <laughs> That's another way I could have told. I could have been able to tell if I didn't have the aim of the coin, because I used Z double edge last time. Okay then. Well, uh, I'm gonna use Super Fang just so that this thing doesn't heal if I use. Oh, was that a poison thing? What? Okay, we're good. We landed Super Fang, didn't get poisoned. That's great. Um, Double Edge should kill. Oh, it does have rough skin. What? Wait. So Z move just negates that? What? Um, I'm really confused. Huh. We got poisoned. Um, as long as we don't die by recoil here, that'd be great. Rough skin plus. Recoil? Is recoil gonna kill us? Okay, we lived. Okay, cool. Everything's all good. Okay, yeah. There's that double money. Sweet. That's what I'm talking about. That was awesome. So, we had a much easier time with that than in the previous one anyway, so... That's nice. Almost died, don't get me wrong. I was almost faint. I almost had radically faint. That was close. That's some scary stuff. Oh, and you'll also see another video drop today, being Nice Guy Shiny Hunter Palm Samayoi, uh, number 27, um, Squardon, number 1, info video, because I'll just be saying, like, that it happened during the stream, <laughs> because obviously uh, I'm not going to be editing that stuff. I'll put a clip on my, you know, on Twitch and everything, but I'm not going to be... Um, yeah, I, I don't know. 
I might just clip it and download that as a video. I don't know. I have no idea what I want to do with that. I've got to decide. I'm going to go ahead and heal Eradicate. That's a Pokemon Center. She has really low health. But she did a good job. She did a real good job. Did a good job. Heal up. That's awesome because I was uh, on my first Twitch account. I found uh, two live friends of party shinies, but at least this one I got one. That's something. You saw how long it took, so that's definitely some patience. Definitely, it was crazy. Too good. Oh man. Oh. So that's more trainers on this route. Got a Max Repel, a Zygarde Cell. This ocean doesn't seem to be that big either. Ooh, it seems like it could be a, a Pokemon in the water over there. Well, come to me, Pokemon. There we go. What is it? What do we got? Oh, Wilmer. Okay, then. Well, we'll probably get to eradicate in the next level because this thing's probably going to give some chunky experience. Oh, 43? Holy moly. Well, first of all, I'm going to super fame this thing. Nice. Pretty good, pretty good. Oh, die. Oh, man. Why do you do this? Well, uh, I'll just use Endeavor. Fine. You couldn't hit it when it was underwater. <laughs> oh, it's calling for help. No! Do not. Don't do this, Whammer. Oh my god. Well, and they're the same level. Holy crap. Okay, I'm gonna double edge the original Whammer. Nice, it landed. Hopefully, it was killed. Amazing, it did. Okay. I'm scared of the second Whammer now because I'm pretty low health. Oh, this thing's gonna. You know what? This would be a perfect time to use Endeavor because I'm gonna be under half health, so. Yeah. I shall use the devil. Oh, this thing calling for help. You better not be successful. You literally, you're full health. Okay, that's what I thought. Good. Jeez, man. What are you doing? Spawn and Devor. Yep, we landed. Now they're going to be the same health as us, which is like 25% health. That's great. Amnesia, that's fine. I'm not using a special attack, so uh, I'm going to use Crunch just so I don't die from Double Edge. So I don't faint on me. Crunch should do the trick still. Yay, cool. Endeavor coming in clutch. And let's level up. Oh, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Pretty sweet. Eradicate put in the work, like usual. Pretty sweet. I eradicate all wet from the dive that Whammer was doing. Two of the Whammers did it. Freaking Whammers, I swear. Ah, oh, man. I think that was the first time I encountered them so far in this game, so. In the wild, at least. Or maybe. I don't know. Either way, they're tough. Especially when it's two versus one. Some scary stuff. Eradicate is all good. Cool stuff. Okay. So who's out next? I believe it is. Da -da -da -da, Aridos. I think Aridos is all good on experience. Yep. Okay. Can give him the aim of the coin. Eradicate her. Eradicate. Yeah. Just give that double edge so we don't have to take recoil. And because it gives us the absolute power. Aridos, you can have the aim of the coin. Do us proud, Ariados. $230,000? Good deal. Oh my god. So close to that backpack. I really want to do that, finish that off in this stream as well. I really want to buy that backpack. 
Ooh, a dust stone. Okay, that's gonna sell for a lot. Oh, another item underwater. Pearl string. Ooh, those sell for like 15,000. Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, a fishing spot. It's flowing. What is it gonna be? A Pokemon? Okay, what do we got? Um, another Whalmer. Well then, there you go. I'm gonna set up an Eridos. Just so that if this thing brings along help. Well, it's only level 32, so it's not going to be that bad. But I'm just going to still use Sword Dance at least once. This thing outsped me somehow? What? How do you do this? How do you do that, Wilmer, huh? How do you outspeed me? Man, there you go. This must be slow as crap. You're 12 levels above. And it oh, still outsped me. It still! It used Water Spout against me. you got to be freaking kidding me. I did so much. Three missile two skills. We did sword dance. Okay, yeah, the quail is dead. <laughs> nice. Poor area dose. It literally only gave us 439 experience. Really? Really? What the heck's up with that? Oh, what is this girl doing here? Is she gonna fight me? Oh, she looked around. What? Oh, I get to fight her if I beat all the trainers on the area first. Ooh. Okay, okay. I feel it. Probably gonna have some strong Pokemon. She's a Hula girl. I think she might have an Oricorio or something like that. It's gonna be a scary one. Usually the master trainers of the route are pretty tough. The trainers already have been pretty tough on the Pokemon too, so... Jeez, I don't know how that's gonna go. Kinda scared. <laughs> I really am. But I believe in my team. We may get close to losing, but we got plenty of items to help them, and their endurance is good enough. I believe in it. Going over a candy, that's all good. But I can sell these new items that I got, and I don't care to keep. Let's see, Pearl String, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's 15,000. Yeah, 15,000 for a Pearl String, 1,500 for the Dust Stone. Oh, we're stacking them the money. That's what I'm talking about. Love it. I love that. We got all these berries. I don't want these berries. The only berry I care to keep is my left berry. I care about these other berries. I really don't. All right. And the max potion too. One thousand two hundred fifty for that. And we're all good. Cool stuff. Sweet there. Alright, so I think, yeah, there was a hula girl walking above on the beach. Wow, it's actually daytime in the game. That's how you know it's like, you know, it's getting late for me. Uh, but it's really not, it's still daytime outside. Oh yeah, I should have looked on the beach for the for any hidden items. That one. There might, oh there is. Where is it? Oh, Pearl, okay. Yeah, I'm glad it came back to me, you never know. I think that was all. Oh no, there's another item, what? Oh, Big Pearl, look at that! Extra money! That's what I'm talking about. Is there anything over here? No, I don't think so. Oh, there's a Pokeball behind that rock, and then there's a berry thing, and then there's this little girl who's fighting me. Lots of stuff is happening, lots of stuff. What does she want? She has one. I bet, she, I bet she's going to have Oricorio. Oricorio, I called it. It's the ghost type one. Ooh. Well, Eridos, this will be great for you because you have Silver Punch. I might. I'm going to scope this thing out, though. I'm going to use, use Swords Dance once. Well, it seems to captivate on me. Okay, that's why. See, that's good though. That I did that. Special attack, hard to spell. That's fine. I'm not using special attack. Oh, dancer. Oh, this thing is sword dance. I forgot that that has an ability. Oh, I'm I'm actually really scared now. <laughs> Cause this thing could sweep me now. Oh crap. I'm hoping that it's going for. I'm gonna go for a sucker punch. Please go for an attack. Okay, good. This should hopefully kill. Oh, yes, it was a one-shot. That thing could have swept me with Sword Stance. Because its dancer ability copies any dance moves its opponent does and uses it at their own. 
So that was scary. That was seriously scary. I thought for sure we were going to get swept there. Ooh, rare candy instruments for 5,000? Oh, baby. Giving me that? Sweet. That's what I'm talking about. What is this? Oh, is this the Pokey Finder? Oh, it's not. What? This looks like it would be a Pokey Finder spot because it's just like a place where someone can stand. That's really weird. Oh, we just got some free berries, though. Crab Brawler blocking them. I mean, uh, hoarding them. Wait a second. I think I might be able to fight the Master Trainer of the route now. Let's see, does she want to fight? Oh, if she didn't, okay. So I haven't beaten all the trainers in the route first. There must be someone I'm missing. Gotta be. Ooh, Zygarde cell. Yeah, there must be like someone. Hmm. No berry pile, no crab brawler still. Oh, here's the last trainer probably, the chef. All right, let's do this. Let's see what the chef can do. Oh, two of them. Two Pokemon. Oh, Parasect. Ooh, okay. Pretty good. Uh, I'm actually going to play smart and just set up against this Parasect. Just in case the next one has just something powerful. Because I can be able to... Oh, it is super effective. What? Oh, because this thing is grass type as well. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna get too greedy. I'm just gonna, um, I'm just gonna sword dance twice, and then I'll go for the pin missile. The pin missiles, um, I don't touch them physically. I just throw stuff at them, so I should be fine. Okay, we ate those attacks up. First, I used slash, and then I used the fury cutter. And then the pin missile. This should probably get a, like a one shot. Oh, almost did. Nice. Oh, critical. We didn't need that, but okay. And we didn't take effects for it. Sweet. Oh, Ariel's just gonna level up. Ooh, we're Bombi. Ooh. This one is not very effective for pin missile, but it's a physical attack zone on plus two, so I'm just gonna go for it. Bug buzz. Um we can eat that up. It's two it's four times not very effective. Yeah, we ate that up. Yep, this were Bombi. Oh we got a critical, oh, that's what it was. Okay, I was like, we did a lot for this up. Pin missile. Oh, can we get two more? Maybe. We we got hit four. We hit four times. We got one of them critical and two critical hits in four of those. Holy crap! There we go. Can you get that poison jab though? A top off be the icing of this battle. Wait a second. Psychic. I don't want. Wait, what? Oh, I guess I don't have it on him end game because. Why don't I don't have this end game. What? Oh, because I have Sword Dance. Okay. But Psychic is pretty good still. Um, I, I would give it a Nightshade. I don't mind because having a powerful Psychic type move. You know what? Screw it. Yeah. Nightshade is like I use sometimes. So, you know what? I might as well have that be the move I use sometimes or just a lot of the time. Wait a second. I have an ambient point on Aerials, right? Okay, because that's Chef. I thought I forgot to put it on there. I was going to have a mini heart attack. I was going to say I have to freaking reset all that again, but now I'm good. I'm all good. I think Incineroar is all good to be next. Yeah, he's all good. Give him the end point of Aerial back to Darkinium Z. All these berries, oh my god. Hold on. Here we go, Aerial. Back to Darkinium Z. Cinderor, Amulet Coin. Nope, not Pearl. Amulet Coin. I feel like that was last trainer on this route because I'm getting close to the place where I'm supposed to meet Hapu at. So, should be all good. 
Yeah. I feel like I'm gonna keep. Yeah, this has to be the end of Route 15. So there's a gateway to where it leads into another area. So I should be able to take on that trainer now. Cool stuff. So she should want to be able to take me on now. Making sure I have the enemy coin on because I don't want to screw up. Okay, I have the enemy coin. So what does she have? I feel like she's going to be very tough. She most likely doesn't have Ori Corio though, so... Oh, she has the Focus Sashes on them. Ooh, that's my favorite held item for online. I love Focus Sash. She must be really confident she's using these offline. Wow. Oh, she has an Ori Corio. Wait a second. I think she has four Ori Corios. Holy crap, am I fighting the Ori Corio Master? Oh my god. I don't know. I'm a little scared. Because <laughs> each of them are very powerful. Oh, this thing is Feather Dance? Oh, thank god I have. Oh no, he's Teeter Dance, not Feather Dance. Well, that's still bad, but I was going to say Darkest Larry just ignores any stat drops on either Pokemon. It's still the same power. She didn't do that much to herself. Air Slash. Oh no, this thing's going to go for the flinch. Oh, we didn't get flinched. We hit Dark Slayer. Can we kill? That would be amazing. Oh, I did like 75% health. That's great. I love it. I hit Air Slash again. Okay, as long as we don't get flinched, I can do this. Oh, I got flinched. Okay, I'm going to heal. Do the eye potion. Heal the pool. That's nice. Another air flash. As long as I don't get flinched, I think I'll be good. Because this thing is doing about, let's see, how much did it do? It did 42 damage. We can eat a few of those. Keter Dance. Oh, he snapped out right after she tried to use Keter Dance on me and said she already confused me. The luck. The luck is too good. That's just what I was looking for. Ooh, another Oratorio. Please be the ghost type. I'll one shot this thing. Oh, no, it's the electric type. Well. That's fine. Uh, I'll just use Dr. Slayer again. Peter Dance. Oh my gosh. This thing is probably going to have Air Slash as well. Oh, that's right. I can't I can't one shot them because they have Focus Ashes on them. That's right. She's going to be a tricky one. She reminds me of myself on online. I rock the Focus Ashes online. Unless I can make evolve. Oh, yes, we missed the Air, they missed the air Slash on us. Can we hit them, please? Oh my gosh. A miracle. We missed. We missed the air slash and then we hit through confusion. Holy crap. Cinderor coming in with the luck. Holy moly. I'm gonna probably level up in this battle. What is this one? The ghost one? Oh no, that's the psychic one. We'll still do good against that. I wanna go for a probably now see me, so I'm gonna use your bite. Why not? See you dance. Can we hit through confusion? No we didn't. Alright, we can eat up these hits from this thing, unless it uses Air Slash. Oh, it did use Air Slash. I think they all have Air Slash. So she is Ori Corio Master. Oh, we snapped out! And we didn't get flinched! Yeah, I know the Focus Dash. I know, I know. It was a critical too. But the Focus Dash, we know, we know. I'm pretty sure she gives us a Focus Dash as well. So that's gonna be cool, because I wanted to eventually grind for those when I beat the game. So just, that's awesome. Focus sashes are great. Teeter dance. Come on, why do you do this? All of them have teeter dance and air slash. What's going on here? Probably feather dance as well. Ah, oh, man. Can we not get flinched and hit through the confusion? I know it's asking for a lot, but no, we got flinched. Okay. Jeez, she's going for the ultimate tactics here. Oh, God. Okay, we didn't get flinched. And we hit ourselves in confusion. Okay, gotta use another hype potion. Well, I'm definitely using my money's worth in this battle. I used three hype potions so far. Jeez. Holy moly. Why do you do this? Oh, she just wasted a move. That's great. Tear dance. Um. Gotta use tear dance again. And we hit ourselves in confusion. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> Come on, Incineroar, you're doing so good. Please hit through. Come to the Cinnamore, you... Oh my god. 
Incineroar. And now this thing's using air slash and Come on, we could have just took advantage of the stupidity. And we got Forge. Oh god. When is this gonna end? When is this madness going to end? Please don't flinch me. Please hit through confusion. We got flinched again. We gotta use another hype potion. I have six of these things left. You've gotta be freaking kidding me. The flinch and the confusion is just a two, is a crazy combo. Okay, at least we missed air slash that time. If we avoided it, I mean. Please land the fight. Okay, please go through confusion. No, that's like four times in a row. You gotta be kidding me. Air Splash, don't flinch at least, and please take your confusion. I know I'm asking for doubles, but you got flinched. Oh my god. Well, we might be here for a while, everyone. Oh, we snapped out! Right as I said that! Yes! The center I'm pretty sure is gonna level up, so I can just switch out. Yay! We actually killed that one. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Or Ikario, that's gonna be the ghost type. Ooh, two cannons. We'll do the trick. That's fine. Those, these freaking Oricorios just have the ultimate strategy. Oh man. Level 43 again. Yep. Alright, beat blast time. Please use a physical move on me. Um, or maybe we can hit through this confusion. That would be cool too. That would be great. Both birds fighting each other. Please hit through. Yes, we hit through. Okay, so just one more. One more attack and this thing's gonna die. I don't wanna mm, I'll use beat blast again, I'm risking it. Screw it. We're going for the ultimate risk. Thing's trying to air slash me, so can we hit the flinch and confusion? Oh my god, two cannon did it. Hit through confusion and air slash. Too good. Too good. Our luck is amazing. Freaking amazing. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Holy crap, that was Probably the hardest battle I've ever done in a while, just because of those tricks, the focus patches. Holy moly, what a high tier trainer. She should be an ace trainer. She's just a hula girl. I guess we don't underestimate any trainer. My god. That was intense. Seriously, that was, that was some crazy stuff. Sorry for the background. Um, one of my brothers uh, is breathing. The raging probably at something game or something, I don't know. Either way, they're being rude because I'm working. Whoever it is. That's good that I cleared this whole route. That is awesome. So I'm hoping that she gives me a focus patch. I really hope she does because so far when these special trainers use those kind of items that give me like that thing that they use so I hope she gives me at least one so that would be some cool stuff two cannons wants a lot of love probably Incineroar as well Incineroar takes so many hits really tanks the hits in general sorry again for the background all right Two cannons all good. Yep, Incineroar is probably full of fur. Yeah, look at that. Three fur. Jeez, just like two cannons. Alright. Definitely gonna go stock up on having a total of ten high potions, but I think I used four during that battle. Jeez, that was such a crazy battle, like I said. The luck is real on this stream. <laughs> Kinda hoped it would because it's a special ten hour Tuesday stream, you know. That is pretty nice. Okay, everyone's all good. Good stuff. Cinema's all gonna be out. Uh, not in front. Two cannons should be out next. Give me focus patch, please. Yay, she did! She gave me the focus patch. Yay, I only have to grind for five more then. And I beat this game. Hooray! Okay. Okay. Cinnaroar, you have 
Let's do my Mallet EV. And we can, I believe, right at the out in front. Yep, he's all good. He's all good. We can have Hanging Coin. Okay, now I can finally go meet Hoppy. Now that I cleared this route. All the Pokemon are almost level 46. That is great. Stacking up on the training. For sure. That is awesome. Oh, man. Feels good to battle again after grinding so many hours in that shiny hunting grind. Find that shiny in the French Safari. But it was worth it. It was so worth it. Because we found that shiny Star Buck. It's so good. I loved it. Reminds me of Peanut Butter Dakota. It really does. Peanut Butter Deer. Exactly what that was. Alright, so what stuff do we got to sell? I don't think we have anything to sell. I don't think so. Oh no, we got some pearls. That's some good stuff. Okay, yeah, we definitely... 4,000 for the big pearl, 1,000 for the little pearl. That's nice. Uh, rare candy, that's 5,000. Awesome. We want to buy four hyper potions. Oh, there's lots of berries to sell, too. Interesting looking berries, but I don't care about them. So I don't care about them. I only care about my lucky berry. Alright. And buy four hyper potions. Dang, 262,000. We're stacking. Almost 100,000 more than we get that backpack. Excited. I am excited. Oh, we gotta go around. I almost forgot. Music is epic in this track. But, now to go meet Hapu. And we should be getting a new ride pager. And we can go explore some places. I'll have to look up where exactly I can go to. But I'll definitely explore them. Ah, Hapu! Or Mudsdale. Hello, Mudsdale. Where's Hapu at? Huh? Oh, there's Hoppy. He was in the house. I love that thing Lily does when she goes like this, and she's like happy, she's like, Oh, do we have to go to the rooms? I guess we have to go back. Okay, but she's going a different way, though. So... Oh, someone's sneaking, looking through the arch hole. It's so creepy. She's just, like, here looking in on us. Yep, Machamp, we're going to be using you as a ride pager. I think this is the final ride pager of the game. It's the Machamp. I believe so. So that is pretty cool. <laughs> it's so cool, he's carrying us in his arms. That's awesome. I guess we don't go to the that one island yet. Alright, well, I wanna go and see what places can I use the Machamp ride pager at that I've been to. I'll look that up real quick. So if I miss chat, um forgive me for that because I'm looking on another tab. Uh Pokemon Moon 
camp ride picture location. So the build the huge rocks at. Areas and chant rides. Okay, here we go. That's the correct one. Hitting one was the chant ride. Oh, we can go get the flying in Z. Lush jungle. Ten carat hill. Diglett cave. Okay, so first, ten carat hill. Let's go to that place first. Should be on the first island, I think. Oh no, the second island. Uh, tanker, where is it? That's Memorial Hill, where's Tanker? Oh, maybe it's on the Ula Ula. No, that wouldn't make sense. It must be on the first one then. Oh, it was. <laughs> Okay, we can go get that Fly Indian Z. I don't think any of my Pokemon on my team I want to have the Fly Indian Z on. Maybe Lightning, but no. I'm a Fly Indian Z still. Okay, well. Alright, what do we got? Just some calories too. Zubat, it's all good. Take you down. Easy peasy. Um, my bullet speed is still do the trick. You know, it's four times not very effective. This thing is like level 13. Yeah, we got this. One did half health. You know, it's four times not very effective. Easy peasy, bullet speed. Easy peasy. Okay. Should be over here. No, that's not it. Here it is. A champ, I call upon you to push this rock out of the way. Yay! Awesome. That's one down. Should be the fly in and you should be over here. Oh, another one did with hello there. You're gonna get one shot in with Rock Smash. You're gonna get destroyed. So get out of here. Yeah, my as well you might as well, so I'm going to heal anyway before I actually continue the main story. Yep. Yep. Okay, so... Hey, it's like, we go over here? No, we can't. Okay, we go over here, though. That's the place you want to go. Oh, Rog and Roller, hello there. Well, because you probably have sturdy, maybe bullet speed. So hit multiple times. Bullet speed, go. Yes, you finished. Goodbye, Rog and Roller. Oh, didn't have sturdy, and we ran into critical hit. Very necessary, but okay. <laughs> I'll take it. I will take it. Oh, here's the flying in Z. I shall, before I take it, look around. Are there any items around here? No? You're not flying in Z. Yay, flying in Z. Cool stuff. Okay, so now, what was the next place? It said Lush Jungle, I think? Yeah. Lush Jungle on Second Island. So in there, it's okay. Lush Jungle. This thing. Okay. Alright, in the Diglett's Cave, I know where that is, I'm pretty sure. 
It's like where the meadow is. It's like the hole you go in to find Cosmo. I'm pretty sure. Either way, Lush Jungle, here we come. We going in. It's been a while since I've been in Lush Jungle. Some good memories. But, yeah. Came here for one reason. That's for the Machamp thing. So let's see where it is. I have no idea where it's at. Oh, it must be... Okay, it must be this way then. See an area where I haven't gotten a TM yet. So it must be over here. Got it. No, what? Okay, how do I get over there then? Wait, what is this? Oh crap, this just leads to a TM that I never got before. What? How did I miss this? Okay, that was fortunate that I found that. I would have just never came back here and just forgot about that. I thought you needed the Machamp Drive Pager for that. What? Wow. That's awesome. What a fortunate mistake. This is awesome. So good. <laughs> wow, I can't believe that just happened. The stuff you find on accident sometimes. It's hilarious. Alright, ain't hold back in your parents. I'm using a boot slap. You're level 21. Oh, you stung for on us. Paris. Don't get paralyzed. And we got paralyzed. Okay. Well then. Paris, don't do it. Absorb, okay. Not gonna do much. Literally did one damage, please. Okay, good. He black landed. Good. Good stuff. Gotta heal up that paralysis. We don't want none of that. We do not want none of that. Alright. Two cannon was so sad. Don't worry, we're gonna heal you up, two cannon. We'll heal you right up. So where in Lush Jungle is this Machamp stone thing? I don't know. I really don't know. Gonna search the whole jungle if I have to. But I don't really think about it. I think it's where the pseudo wuda were. I think it's on that rightish side, so I'm actually gonna go over there. But if not, then I'm gonna go to that place where I thought that I didn't have to go because I saw that Pokeball. A TM Pokeball the yellow. So, I'll go to the right to where the Pseudo Wuda are, because I believe it's like upward. You gotta push a rock upward. Somewhere over there. I'm having like vague memories about it. Kind of doing a uh, process of elimination in my head right now, because it's been, I don't know how long since I've been in Lush Jungle, because I haven't been here since the trial. So it's been a long time, a very long time. Okay. Oh, alright. Go back this way. Oop, okay, that's not the right way. <laughs> this way, here we go. Should be where the Machamp thing is. Here it is, here's the Machamp thing. Yay! Knew it. What? Oh, I was like, why am I not pushing it correctly? It's down here, I see. I see now. But what is over here? Oh. <sighs> A Zygarde cell. Excuse me. Oh, another Machamp thing. Okay, okay. Oh, encountered. Maybe it's going to be some good encounters. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, wait. Is this Diglett Tunnel? I think this might be a two in one. Cause I think it said Lush Jungle and then Diglett Tunnel. Is this? It's level 18. This might be Diglett's Tunnel. Being that I came across the Diglett in the first encounter in here. So, maybe. Hmm. I don't know. I think it is. I feel like it definitely is. Oh, wait a second. Oh, this is the place. This is that one mining area, isn't it? 
Oh wait, no it's not. What? Where, what the heck? What is this place then? What? There's an entrance. What is this? There's even an item right here. Rare candy. That is interesting. What is this place? Oh, and then we got the Tapu areas as well. I almost forgot about that. Well, my knowledge, um, got that sandstorm place. I think it said every one of them except for Tapu Coco. Hmm. There's only four in total, four Tapus in total. One is in the desert. One is... Why did I, why did I use Bee Blast? I don't know. Oh, because it's level 20, that's why. Now I know. I'm very confused about this area. It's really weird. Where does this lead to? Oh, wait. I think this is where that one place was. It's where we're going down this route. Cool. So this is not Diglett's Tunnel, so I still gotta go to the Diglett's Tunnel. Diglett's Tunnel is on this island, I believe. No? Um, first one then? Yeah, it's this one. It's up here. Mealy Mealy Meadow, that's where it is. So I think... Oh wait, no, 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 Diglett's Tunnel is right under that one cave. Now I remember, I was thinking Diglett's Tunnel was in that Mealy Mealy Meadow, but that's called Seaward Cave, it just said. Oops, um... Hia Hia City, and then Diglett's Tunnel should be downward. Okay. And then the top is next. So there's not actually that many Machamp places, I thought there was way more. But there isn't. Interesting. Oh wait, isn't... Uh, I don't know. This is where Diglett's Tunnel is, but... I don't know. Yeah, this is Diglett's Tunnel. I remember, I'm pretty sure it was near the entrance, that Machamp place. Is it over here? I think it's up these stairs, I'm pretty sure. If not, it's like down near the stairs, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I'm just guessing at this point. There is an hour left of the Grand 10 Hour Tuesday stream. It's about time. <laughs> 10 hours is quite a long time. Uh, even if you do stuff that's fun, 10 hours in general is pretty insane. It's the longest I ever streamed uh, in general, but when I actually finish it, it'll be great. I don't know how long it's going to take to upload the video, but no, it's going to take quite longer than obviously the four hour one. Let's do that. Alright. By the way, what an adventure this stream was. It's not even finished yet, but I'm just looking back on today in general because it took pretty much all day. Oh man. Confused, Ray. Oh man, do that. Why you do this? Please. I don't, I'm having flashbacks to the Ori Corio battle. Oh, we hit ourselves. Oh no. I'm gonna risk bullet speed. Screw it. Oh, it snapped out. Yay. Ugh, we don't do that much. We hit three times though. Can we hit four times? Oh, we hit four times? I don't think force is gonna kill though. Oh no, that one health is probably gonna call him for help. Peace, yeah, I, I'm probably, it's probably going to calm down. I got like a one health. Literally one health. Oh, it didn't. What? My lucky day. My lucky day. Get out of here, Z-Bat. Ooh, yeah. That was crazy. Good stuff. Okay, so, the champ place, where are you? I think it's over here. If I remember... What the? Shaker spot. Get it. I think it's going to be a diglet. And it is. <laughs> I thought so. It was a rustling spot in the ground. It's kind of obvious it would be a diglet. But you never know. There's other ground type Pokemon, of course. I don't know, man. 
and a one shot, of course. I'm gonna lay down now. My back is getting pretty sore. Set this back up to normal. And I should be able to just lay down till the tenth hour. Till seven oh five. Let me see, is this all good now? Yeah, I think so. Alright. It should be this way the the champ sings. Yay, I was right. My memory served me. I knew it was like on this right and this left side because I remember saying to myself, Oh, I can't wait until I get him a champ, Ride Page Ride Page. If I can speak, Ride Page <laughs> Oh my god. What is over here? Better be something nice. <gasps> An entrance to the outside. Whoa, there's a trainer right there. What the? What? That guy was waving at this girl? Oh, this is the lighthouse! Oh, we got Will of Wisp. Okay, okay. Can we go in the lighthouse? That'd be cool. Better be able to go in the lighthouse. Three. What? I can't even go in the lighthouse? You've got to be kidding me. What kind of crap is that? Why do you do this? Why? So this girl's waving to someone at Hia Hia City. So I'm gonna go over there and talk to that guy. Cause maybe since I talk to her, something special happens. You never know. Secret stuff like that could be be a thing. I ain't gonna risk not checking it. Cause why not? And then we got the Tapu areas to explore. Um. Yeah, and then I'm all good to continue the story. What? Is, where is this guy at? Where is he? He's over here. Here he is. What? He was waving at her before when I was over there. Okay, I see how it is. Freaking dude, what are you doing? Alright, so where are the Tapu ruins? Besides, I don't think, oh, I'm going to double check. I think it said every one of them is set for Tapu Coco. Let me just double check. But I want to just go all the way there for nothing. Yeah, all the Tapu temples, except for Tapu Koko. Okay, just making sure. Alright, um... Ruins of Life? What? Oh, that's... Oh, one of the ruins, okay. First, I'm gonna heal up, sell some stuff, and then I'll go there. Got a lot of stuff to sell. That is nice. Oh, um, I'm gonna check Cold Pelago as well. So I want to say it's been about an hour. I don't know. So time flies. Time flies. Oh, yeah. Oh, and Magnemite wants to come with me. Yay. Sorry you left, but, um, Magnemite, I'll release you, though, once I get you in my PC. Alright. Can I pick the peck? This might be a shiny. Who knows? That would be cool, though. But if not, oh well. Nope, that's my own pick the peck. Okay, dope. Yep, that's cool. Alright. Leave the Poke Pelago. Um, release that Magnemite. Buy some stuff. Not buy some stuff, sell some stuff. And then be on our way to the top of the temples, except the top of Coco. So, there's only two I can go to right now because the next one is actually where you're supposed to go in the story. The Ruins of Abundance, I think it's called. Oh no, maybe, no, I, I forget what it's called, but I know Ruins of Life is that one I'm about to go to next, and then, yeah, so I don't think the Toppies are going to be in there, 
If they are, then I'm probably going to catch them. Because I don't think you can shiny hunt them. I think they're shiny locked in this game, so... Might as well catch them and then, like, I don't know. If anyone wants them, then just let me know. I'll probably just give you to them. Give them to you, I mean. So, yeah. Because I'm most likely not going to ever use them. Flying so Z, that's great. Alright. So, flying to the ruins of life. I think it's literally just going to be like up here somewhere. Pretty sure. It's been a while since I've been over in this area. Oh, yeah, it's literally right here. This is where you beat Olivia. That's hilarious. <laughs> it's not in the challenge of, like, doing this. Um. Oh, okay. Yep, the champ. Come forward. I call upon you. So I think it's only post game that they actually are in the temple, but I think maybe there might be an item or something? That'd be cool. Um, so, okay, let's go left. Gotta really pay attention to where these holes are so you can actually pass through. And is that it? Oh, well that was easy. So what's over here? Is that gonna be the top room or? No, I don't think, unless I can. It says I can in interact with this statue. Mm, maybe I can. That would be cool. I would definitely try to catch the thing. Come on, uh. Touch the stat. Oh, okay. I think it's only when I become champion, because then when I reach touch the statue, then something will actually happen, I'm pretty sure. I think that's how that works. But anyways, whatever. The top of the ruins are so creepy, the music. It's so scary. I'm gonna get out of here. Okay. Then the... Oh, we can just fly the ruins above that. If I can speak. Ruins of Abundance, because last time I had to do that whole puzzle in that one stream, the whole sandstorm place. That's great, I can just fly to it. Perfect, that's so convenient. It makes my job easy peasy. Easy peasy. Yep, going in. We going in. What do we got? Um, uh, let's see. I don't know. Um, well, I... Yeah, we gotta go this way. Okie doke. I think we only push this a little bit just so we can move. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I can't pass by that screen. So I think this is how you do that. Yeah, perfect. Easy peasy as well. Easy. That's what I'm talking about. So I'm going to touch this, this statue as well. I'm going to save first just in case you never know. Never know, this one might be a tricky one just to fight me right away. It maybe. Maybe it's probably gonna get the same reaction. Yep, it did. Okay, well, bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Alright, well, at least I locked the whole puzzle thing. Oh no, it resets for this one. Oh, that's annoying. Well then. Fine. Fine then. The champ, please help me out. Please. Get out of here. Do -do -do -do. Um, this one. Oh, that's why it's there, so we can get out this way. I see. Very clever, Game Freak, Nintendo. Very clever. Very clever. Well, we can just go back to where I left off. Um, that would be... I didn't mean to press B. Uh, that would be... This? Yeah, Seafolk Village. That's the nearest place we can fly to. You can explore that place, that whole town, Hoppy's hometown. The Seafolk Village, that's not Hoppy's hometown. That's not. Um, how much money do I have? I don't think I have enough to buy the backpack, but it should be pretty close. Yeah, 267,000. I think, how much is it again? 284? I mean, 384? No, 378,000. Okay, so I'm almost 100,000 more until I get there. To buy it. That's awesome. Like I said, I might get lucky enough to have much money by the end of the stream to actually go and buy it. That would be sweet. I love completing my ultimate outfit in games that I can do that in. This would just like add an extra feel to the to like being your character, you know? 
That's what I think it is. Alright, Oppie's hometown. Ancient Pony Pack. What do we have? Um, I don't want to go back there yet. Oh, I'm a champ in the yard. What are you doing, the champ? Oh, a Zygarde cell right there. Oh, another one. Wait, it's full of Zygarde cells. Sweet. Give me that. That's mine. Okay. Oh, we got a call from Gina. We got 50% of all the cores? Nice. We can just get 50% of the form of Zygarde if we wanted to, but nah, not interested. I'll just leave him with Sina and Dexio. Oh, we can go back here. I thought it was like an archway to another area. Oh, there's an item over here. See, that's why I have my little salad up. Reviver? We can sell that because we already have 99 of those. We already have 99 of these. Cool. Okay, we can go in the house then. What is in the house? Hello, Meow. How you doing? Alright, let's go over here. <gasps> A pink Zygarde thing! Yay! Another moon thingy. Cool stuff. Sorry about the background. I was arguing. Oh, Rockwell. Hello, Rockwell. Oh, Mill Tank and <gasps> Muzzdale. Oh, wait. Muzzdale just healed us. Or not Muzzdale, just Mill Tank healed us. That's awesome. Must have drank its milk or something. I don't know how we just got healed. That's nice. Oh, a Sudowoo. I almost thought that that was just a plant. What? It just said live. I didn't know Sudowoo can talk. What the, what the heck's going on here? Yeah, that's creepy. I don't, I don't know Suda Wudu can talk. Alright then. That was the bedroom. Okay, so. Cool, we explored that house. Cool stuff. An item right here. I want this. Give me the item. Run to Southland! Oh, we got encountered. What is the encounter? What is it? A gumshoes! I haven't seen a gumshoes in the wild yet, I'm pretty sure. Nice! Pretty neat. Oh, 40? Oh god. That's a scary one. Alright, these last just for you, because you're probably going to use a physical attack. And you did. Now you burn. Now you can't call for help. Just my plan. <laughs> gumshoes. Oh, and burn's going to kill you, I think. Oh, you're on one health. Wow. Well, here's a rock smash for your face. A pow in your face. That was a good one. That was a good one. Ooh, I get so much experience. I think two cannons is ready to level up with a while though. I think so. You ready, two cannons? No, almost. Well actually Yeah, no, not yet. Adrenaline orb, okay. Run back. Oh, another encounter. Okay, after this one, yeah, two cannons gonna be ready to grind up if he doesn't get to grind level up in this one. Teleport, that's gonna be a lot of experience. Well, um, oh, Grizzle, okay. Okay. I think I'm just gonna be using Bullet Seed, because it's neutral, uh, and I don't wanna have this thing stall me out. Can I use Beast Blast and then use Protect? That would be annoying. So, I mean, Bill Seed isn't doing a huge amount, but uh, I think I might just stick with that for now. I'm gonna hit five times? Four times. It's still pretty good. Okay, now I'll use Beast Blast. This thing is Swallow, so maybe I'll get lucky. Roost? Oh. That's fine. Beast Blast is still gonna do a lot, anyways. Okay, I'm going to use Bullet Seed, this thing calling for help, please don't be successful. Good. So Bullet Seed, as long as I hit it multiple times, should be able to kill this thing. 
No, hopefully it doesn't call for help and or uses. Sweet. Okay, three times. Um, one more please. Yeah, it should kill. The lucky four. Oh my god. Nice. Oh, I got two cannon to level up. 1,400 experience. Jeez. That's nice. That is nice. I'll absolutely drenched two cannon. Look at you. Look at you all dried. The Porygon air dryer thing. And here is a bean just for you, mister. Alright, now to pet your beak. Wants a lot of love. Gee, he just still wants a lot. Likes the petting on the beak. There you go, now he's all good. That took a while. Why you gotta respect Pokemon, you know? Alright. Young Shoes, I believe, is all ready to be out in front. Yep, he's got a while until he levels up. You can you can have your Phytanium V now and then Amit Coin can go to Young Shoes. Yeah, I think this guy is not going to let me pass. There might be something on behind the sign. I think I remember the lights that's what it was. Guess not. Maybe it's only at night time that the Zygarde spell there. Because I think that's what it usually is here. Maybe not. Oh, I know over here is a Pokeball. I remember seeing that. Ooh, shiny stone. Cool. That's to evolve like Togetic and stuff. So that's cool. So this guy didn't let me pass or no? Oh, I need permission from the Kahuna. I see. Okay. I see how it is. I know I can't go up in that area yet because that is blocked off until I. The champion. Oh. A, co a collector is just looking at me through there. And he spotted me. Well then, that's quite creepy. He's looking through a hole in the wall. He's got two Pokemon, Collector Raymond. Turtonator, whoa, I don't think I've fought one of these before in this game yet. Turtonator is a cool one. Reminds me of Bowser from Mario. Hello, 43. Um, please tell me we put the Amulet coin. Yeah, we did, good. Right, we're all good then. Um, yeah, I haven't fought one of these before in this game. There's no data. What he said is stuff about super effective and all that. I'm gonna go for hype thing after I defeat this enemy. Yeah, I know this enemy is tanked. Look at that. So you can't see it, but it looks very tanky. Oh, flames on Please don't burn me. I heard that a lot. I almost did half. Please kill the type of thing. Yay! Good. Turn your ear down. Grandpa, wow, he's just a dragon master. Those are two exclusive, I mean there's one more dragon type exclusive to Generation 7, but Grandpa's a crazy one. Oh, Berserk, 
Oh, special attack throws. Oh, crap. You might die here. Faint, I mean. <gasps> Gumshoe toughened it out one health. Don't miss Gumshoe, please. Can we kill? Gumshoe's with the luck. We wouldn't have got killed, but we live on one because he loves me so much. I'm so happy. We gotta go back to Mill Tank. Because it heals us, so we don't have to go all back. Oh, yeah, I forgot the Stargard spell. Good thing I went back. Because I would have just passed by this. I almost forgot about that. Wow. Dang. That's crazy. No, thank you. Kill me, please. Thank you. Thank you so much, no, thank Alright. Good stuff. Well, we going back to where that collector was. Uh, Gumshoes is still a wild love love, I believe. Yeah. 2,200 more experience. They got so lucky, dude. Oh, Dragon Type Collector Master. Crazy. Wait, am I actually able to go up there? Or. Wait, for real? Is someone gonna block? I feel like someone's gonna block this. Should be an item over here. Aha. A PowerPoint helped us for itself for a lot. Sweet. So I'm pretty sure we're gonna get blocked off. Yeah, what a oh my gosh. It literally looks like we just can continue, but I have to be champion first. Alright, fine, fine. Oh well. Well I guess I'll go down the path I'm supposed to go. Wait, where's this? Can I get this? Or Whoa, what is... Oh, this girl, okay. Let's fight. Let's battle. She's on her phone. Are you playing Pokemon Go, huh? Sand true. Oh yeah, that's right. These kind of sites here, they have like Kanto versions of the ones who would have been a low end Pokemon. I love that. That's so cool. Um, Sand Shrew is not that bulky, so I'm just gonna go for Ice, I think. Should be a one shot. Oh, it lives on red health, okay, I see. I see you. The Crunch should do the trick. You won't miss the Crunch. Yay. Good stuff. Didn't get that much experience, but still. Oh, Geodude, what a little Geodude. Um. Well, I mean, what's that? You don't have great special defense. He is decent. Maybe you'll miss whatever you're trying to use. Ah, uh, he's double edge. Okay, that's not great for me. You do? You don't have rock head, though. That's, uh, the ability is funny enough, because I... That's the best ability on Geodude in Gravel and Gold. Maybe we got a critical head and crunch. I mainly know that because uh, today, way earlier today, when I started out the day, that was the moose that I researched. And now they have a graveler. She has a graveler. Oh dang. Um, I'm gonna see the thing. Uh, oh, you self destruct. Can we eat that up? <gasps> we live on five health! My luck! And Gumshoe's got to level up. Holy crap. Well, Gumshoe, you're all good. You can switch out. Ledian's gonna be out in front. Jeez. Gumshoe's just coming in with the luck. Like, that's crazy. That's so crazy. We'll take, should be able to take him down decently easy. But I've got an air slash for you. Take this. Oh, you ate that up. Safeguard, though, that's fine. Well, if you eat a special attack, um, I'll just use a all out tumbling on your face. How about that, Boltig? The tanky one.
Alright, what were they doing? Um, oh, they almost killed. Well, they not punch. Hold on, I'm just doing something. Alright, oh well. Um, oh, she was waiting here for me to press A. I don't know what she was doing. Alright, gumshoes, we're all good. Did a good job. So did Lightning. That was a close one. Gun shoes just want a lot of love. All right. Oh, lighting's all good. Okay, cool. All good. What do you want to see? The lighting's got a wild trade of that. Oh, you can have the Dark Kingdom Z back when she's. And lighting can have the Amulet one. Alright, we'll heal everyone and we'll go back to that mill tank. Just in case. But also, hold on. Gotta refresh Twitch on my computer just to see everything was all good. I think everything's all good still. Oh, it's loading. Okay. Well, might as well I'm waiting. We'll just go to the milk tank. Oh, what? Huh. Alright. I don't know what happened. I guess the chat, if I refresh the page, it's like, resets it? That's weird. 
So sorry if any of you like typed anything when I was like refreshing the page. Sorry about that. But I'll, when after I just like save this on Twitch, I'll just see anyways. No apologies. Um, and you can write, you can retype it again. You know, it's still here. But if not, then we're all good. Oh, this should be where the yeah, where the gym is. Cool. Can't jump on the water, it seems. Ah, an encounter. Oh, the gum shoes, nice. All right, let in. No, hey, I guess I might as well go with an. I was gonna say all up humbling, but I don't have to do this because you're on front. Uh, I'll just do a basic mock punch then. See how much that does. Oh, it didn't do that much at all. I thought it was gonna do a lot more. Can't be crunching that stuff. Ooh, yikes. That did a lot. Uh, Bug Bud, maybe that was good. Maybe. Nope, this thing is a tank. An absolute tank. Uh, yeah, it's not good. I'm gonna go ahead and switch out. Alright, Katie, you know what to do. Nice. You missed the Super Fang on us. And now I'm going to be using the Double Edge. Levy, I think now is ready to level up in the wild for the next level. I mean, train up in the wild for the next level. Alright. I think Levy wants to get taken care of too. This guy took a pretty hit in that battle. Hit pretty hard, not pretty hit. <laughs> I don't know the wording on that. That was weird. Alright, let's see about Levian. No, Levian's perfectly fine. Okay. Nice. Frost Breath. Ooh, interesting. Well, I believe Levian, like we said, is ready to train up for the next level. No, he's not. Okay, I thought he was really close. Never mind then. Ah, but another encounter in the wild. We gotta switch because most likely he can't be able to handle. Yeah, no. Even if it's a Pelipper. Not risk it, but I want to go back and heal with no tank. Please, no tank. Eradicate. Please, help me. Help me, Eradicate. This Pelipper is most likely not going to get one shot. I think last time I tried to do this, and it did not work. Let's see. Oh, it was a one shot. Wow. I would have sworn another time that wasn't the case. But now I think Ledian is ready to train in the wild. Yeah, he's ready. He is ready. But he shall have a Darkinian Z back. Not Darkinian Z. 
If I can use you. And I'll let Radicate keep that. Um, I'm not going to be on for now. Just until Lightning gets the next level. You know, just in general, I might as well just switch train right here. Just because I think Lightning, even at full health, would not be able to take down these things. Maybe Color Crow he could have, but whatever, it's too late. Radicate does not mind helping out. There's Drizzle on this teleport, okay. Alright. Alright, Radicate. I think it's all 43, so I don't think they're gonna one shot it. But maybe, maybe. Wow, we actually did it. That don't. That's crazy. I thought for sure that we were not going to be able to. And Ledian wants one double edge. I am so happy. So now the only one who doesn't have a complete moveset, their complete moveset is, I believe it's only Cinemar and Aridos. Because Gumshoes, well, I don't know exactly about Gumshoes yet, because of the whole strong draw thing. But I'm going to keep Hyper Fang over. Uh, thrash with a bite move and so we have strong jaw. So I don't know. So that's awesome. Double edge on Ledian. That's so awesome. Now I'll just be giving him the Normalium Z. So the Phytinium Z. Just so he doesn't get recoil from that. Lighting somehow got drenched? What? Just from being out in one turn? That's interesting. But okay. <laughs> Alright. Almost out of red beans. Only three more red beans left. That's crazy. So crazy. He wants a lot of love. All good. Okay. Well, I didn't even have no mind, Z. Hey, thanks. Uh, no, I'm actually inside. Uh, Lemon Grabber and, uh, what's up, Shake, uh, Shaka? Yeah, I actually sleep in this tent, believe it or not. <laughs> Lonely Lodge? Oh, isn't that like a Fortnite thing, Cry? I'm pretty sure that is. Lonely Lodge. I, I recognize that name. 
But no, I just, I mean, I've used this, it's actually a pretty special tent. Back in the day, when I was, like, way younger, um, when we used to, like, go traveling and all that, um, used to actually use this tent for camping, just for, like, you know, it was pretty cool. It's really weird. <laughs> so it is Fortnite. Um, Lemon Grabber, this right here, that's what you're asking what I'm holding? Oh, it's a Nintendo Duty. If I could speak, Nintendo 2DS XL. I'm actually playing the Pokemon Moon on it. Sadly, I don't have a tripod, so I don't have like. Uh, I can't show you the gameplay, but eventually when I do, I can have so much more content. But um, yeah, that's why I just call it just chatting, cause you know you can't really see most of the gameplay most of the time. Sorry about that. But like I said, eventually, hopefully. Thanks, man. Yeah, sadly, I gotta depend on, like, you know, donations and stuff, because, um, I may be pretty young, but I have, like, arthritis and weak bones and a lot of other health problems, so I can't get a normal job, sadly. That's why I gotta do stuff like this and hope for, like, donations and stuff, but pretty much that's a weight on itself, so, yeah, hopefully I do have luck with the grind. Thanks, man. And speaking of, like, Lemon Grab, uh, did you get your name from Adventure Time from that one guy who's literally called Lemon Grab? I am 18, Chaka. That's why I said it's crazy to have, well, I'm turning 19 next month, but, you know, it's, it's just still young to have, like, these kind of health problems. It's pretty rare. Rare in a bad way. Yeah, Adventure Time. Woo, I love Adventure Time. I'm pretty sure I watched the whole series back then. They probably added more episodes recently, I think, but Adventure Time is a cool one. It's really interesting and weird. <laughs> it's usually how I like things in general. Yeah, good old Adventure Time. I don't know how many years it's been since I actually finished watching that, but it's a good one. It's a memorable thing. Yeah, any like stuff you guys want to like know, like advice or anything like that, um, just let me know. Cause like I said, it's just chatting, but I'm just like playing Pokemon Moon just to pass the time. But um, yeah, any stuff you want to hear, any stories or anything like that, just let me know. Yeah, Shaka, I already finished school, high school. Because I'm 19, so it's like, you know, pretty much just chilling out for home and now just trying to make a career off of this. Oh, okay. Well, it's pretty much like when you're, when you like are 14 and then 14 to like 18, that's usually, you should be like in high school for four years. And then there's like, you start out as like a freshman and then a senior. I didn't, I don't exactly know because I just did online school for the whole uh, high school part just because I was in public school, I was just like so distracted, so I got pretty bad grades. But when I'm just like not distracted, I'm actually pretty smart. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much what high school is. It's a form of education that usually you would have to do. That's like for older um, teens, 
maybe kind of I'm surprised United Kingdom doesn't have uh, high school. That's interesting. I never knew that. But yeah, what I'm most excited for is for this whole Twitch thing is Apparently, when you become like a partner or an affiliate, like you have to reach like certain stats, like fifty followers total, and then I think like seventy-five viewers on average, which is crazy for like me, like being as a beginner. So that's gonna take a long time. But pretty much, what I'm so excited is like the little emojis you can see in chat. I actually want to make my own because I have like art and stuff I made back then, back when. Um, Oh yeah, I do. I do sleep in the tent, Shaka. That's pretty much my bed. Like my blanket, I like lay it on the ground, and then I have like the pillow. Like I can show you. I can like literally grab my camera and, and show you all, <laughs> if you don't believe me. It like takes up seventy five percent of my room. It's crazy. But it's nice. It's like your own world, pretty much. Yeah, definitely, man. Hold on. Take off my headset. So I'm actually using my Kindle to record, so. All right. All right, check this out. See? That's my pillow. And then this is my blanket, and then, yeah. Pretty sweet, huh? <laughs> and then literally when I like want to go to sleep, I'd rack myself up in like a burrito because it's like a huge fluffy blanket and then I just like cuddle in the corner. That's usually what I do. And then I like it because, well, technically lemon gla grabber, but like I said, this is a blanket. So it's like, it's really comfortable and I have a, it's a rug as well. It's not like a hard floor, so I don't mind. If you're wondering why I don't use a bed, a long time ago when I used to sleep on like a mattress, um, you know how like they have, no, Lemon Grabber, it's like, I'll explain. Hold on, let me put this back down. Um, I'm just pretty much afraid of being on like spring mat mattresses because one time uh, when I used to have like sleeping on a bed and mattress, I used to do like a lot of crunches and steps on my bed and then one time out of nowhere this the spring was like popping out and it like poked my back. Thank god I didn't get like paralyzed or anything like that but after that I was just scarred for life and I was like I cannot trust being a normal bed before, anymore so but uh yeah I, I've been sleeping in that like for or memory Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll try that one day, but I really have no problems with, like, sleeping in there. It really doesn't, like, hurt me at all. So if it did, though, then that would be a different story. I know what you mean uh, with, like, it would hurt my arthritis if I'm a grabber, but um, I've been perfectly fine. I've been sleeping in that for, like, over a year. Do you play PS4? I wish, dude, Shaka, I wish I had a PS4. My best friend does. One of the games I love to play, I love to play, uh, Fortnite against him. I love um, Dead by Daylight. That's an amazing game. Uh, I love the exclusive game that's for PlayStation, uh, Little Big Planet. And there's so many other games as well. Uh, but sadly, I only have the candle that I'm using to record. I have my laptop, which I'm like looking at for chat, and can play like games and stuff like that. And then the DS. So that's pretty much what I have for now. But eventually, when I do have like extra money that I don't mind spending, I probably will get a PS4 eventually. Just for like mainly Little Big Planet, because that's like a ex PlayStation exclusive game. Um, but yeah, it sounds fun in general. Usually when I go over to my best friend's house, he has like two PS4s so that we just play in general. But yeah, it sounds awesome.
Well, I, I mean, Shaka, have you played uh, Halo before? That would kind of have you change to like to be having an Xbox just for that, because Halo is an amazing franchise. I mean, you can play some on like the computer as well, but it's mainly for uh, Xbox. Yeah. So, I mean, like I said, PS4 is amazing and all that because there's like a lot of perks, but they are like equal because there's like some stuff that's bad for each console, but they like equal out to make you want to have like both of them. Um, that's what I think at least. But definitely, uh, definitely both are quite good. Just the PlayStation and Xbox, just in general. They always are making better, uh, just to like, equal out their weaknesses and stuff and things they don't have. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I think it is, and even the, like, newer Xbox One, I want to say Xbox One X, I think that's what it's called, so they're both getting upgrades, they, they it's funny because they're rivals, even up to when they upgrade, it's crazy. But yeah, I'm going to be ending off the stream in a few minutes. <laughs> Believe it or not, as you can see in the title, I've been streaming, I'm going to be, have been streaming for 10 hours, because that's just something I'm going to do on Tuesdays, just for like, I'm sure y'all like came by, because like, it's just your time zone, so I, that's exactly why, because I want to reach as many viewers and stuff, and possibly as many fans as possible. Uh, it like gets tough. <laughs> that's the longest I've ever streamed before. Uh, I stream once a day, usually... Uh, for an hour, just pretty much to do the same thing I'm doing now, but on, I'm just starting today, I'm doing like, I call it 10 hour Tuesdays, and I stream for 10 hours straight if I can, if not I would make like a part two, but definitely, uh, I think it's a good, a good thing to do, just so I can have more chance to reach more people, you know what I mean, but some people just like longer streams, and just, even if they join at like, a late time or something, and it's still cool. But literally that was like my whole day because I I'm like awake for 14 hours, but um, oh no I'm awake for 16 hours because obviously I go to like eight hours of sleep, but um, I take like a shower and everything right when I wake up, so that takes off like about two hours getting ready and all that, and then I got videos to record usually on YouTube, so then I would only have like four hours extra to do other stuff just for like uploading and stuff because I'm going to be uploading this to YouTube as well because with like, Twitch if you didn't know um, eventually there's like a limit to how many streams you can hold on your account so eventually when you reach that limit they'll start deleting all the ones that's why like I had an account previously that's why my name on here is Mystery but the title says Paul Samayoi Paul Samayoi is my actual name but Mystery Instant Mayoi is a name I have to pick because my first account I deleted it, so they 
but no one else can use the name Palm Samayo, so I was like, okay, might as well call myself Mystery, but maybe someday Twitch will give me back my uh, original name, that'd be great. But, yeah, I doubt it. Yeah, man, <laughs> you pretty much literally caught me like the end of the stream. Thanks for coming out. All right. I'm gonna save twice and then I'll start to the outro. The grand uh, end of that 10 hour stream. Man, holy crap. So much stuff happened. Alright. Alright. Well, like I said, this was my first ever 10-hour uh, stream. Expect this to be on Tuesdays. Like I said, 10-hour Tuesdays is what I call it. Just to, you know, reach as much of the time zones around the world that I can. Just to reach more potential viewers and possible fans. So, um, yeah, expect this to be on YouTube. I don't know how long this is going to take for the 10-hour video. Probably going to take a few hours. But, um, uh, yeah, just expect this to be on YouTube. And... Um, I'll just see you all next time. I usually just, you know, stream once a day and all that. But anyways, I've been your host, Paul Samayoi. And, Salam, that's goodbye in Filipino, but goodbye. <laughs>